I just wish your heart was baking, baby. Baking, baby. Tell me who's gonna stay lately. When I call you, don't call back. Turn it on and then I fall back. Cause I need to know. If you're still visible. Boy, I know you ain't the same. You're not trying to change you. But can you compromise? I know we need the distance to where you're missing. Do it cross your mind. Don't lie. Don't lie. Tell me, are you happy? 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 Are you happy?
testing God's plan. So, stop him out. The person is like, fuck with God's man. Y'all don't understand the lessons that are coming in the ladder. I don't prepare to stand. So, we'll get all the blessings in the battle. So, eat up with the beat up. Please make sure you listen. See the fact that.
Yeah, it's a good summer. <laughs> it's a good summer to simmer down. Words of affirmation make the conversation more cat. The way we speak is a trap. How we respond and adapt the skill sets and What's up, what's up, what's up? We're back with another banger video. Welcome back to my champ. As y'all can see, I've been back on my vlog again. For sure, as y'all can see, I'm just trying to juggle everything, trying to juggle the the podcast sit down trying to juggle the tiktok trying to still post on instagram with that trying to still get back into the vlogging and editing those videos which editing can be a bit much baby but so i might kind of cut down my duration of my videos but um y'all i love these tom four glasses i really do my sister got these as a gift and i really love them but she ended up getting the wrong size because they come in different sizes and as y'all know y'all can see i have a much slimmer face so around here it's like you know it needs to kind of like be taken in some i need to um look into that place she sent me or that whatever it was um, on instagram or whatever she sent me to see how much they charge and if they can do that i'm about to go for a walk in which i haven't did in a whole entire week let's talk about it baby i haven't been walking or none of that like i was just sitting just been sitting up for the last couple of days the last past two weeks actually just sitting up thinking how like certain things when you just bring it into your life or just start to focus on the wrong things it throws your entire frequency out way back when if you go back into my vlogs and stuff like that like i was way more locked into myself i was way more focused and locked into myself and you know focused on god and stuff like that not to say that i'm not focused on him now because i truly am i'm still locked in but it's like when you lock in with other things and other environments other people food and stuff like that it throws off your frequency even when you're not even when you are still locked in with god it still interferes with that but like my frequency been off even going back to my videos if you just realize like me getting up with certain stuff on my spirit that's where all that me being in the bed talking about stuff and all of that like god putting a whole lot of stuff on my spirit and on my heart and my mind and stuff like that it hasn't been as consistent with that lately for a while where he's just like putting stuff on my spirit or just naturally it's just like overflowing like you know it hasn't been the same the joy just certain energy and certain certain things in your spirit you just realize the difference when you get distracted by certain things or when you're doing certain things or when you're engaging in certain in, in certain things or being in certain environments and stuff like that you just start to realize how the frequency shifts and that's how i feel like it's been for me that's how i've been feeling I haven't been in my bag the way that and when I say in my bag like I haven't been focused and I know that the fact that I know that that's a good thing to be aware is to be alive like yeah I need to lock back in I need to get back refocus and just telling God like man just help me to you know like realign re man get me back together like and I ain't saying like you know bad way I'm just saying even the, just the little things the the simple the simplicities the simple things that are so small or seem so small is like I'm knowing that this is throwing off my frequency I'm knowing that my frequency my vibe my I'm knowing that it's not the same it's not where it was I feel like I was on the right path and I still feel like I'm on the right path, but I feel like the energy has shifted. So I said to myself today, self, <laughs> realign, realign, baby. Like go for a walk, even though I don't feel like it, I feel restless at the end of the day. But a lot of times we just not gonna feel like doing stuff. Like, but discipline is to do the things that we don't feel like doing or we don't want to do, still doing it. You know what I'm saying? So that's where I'm at with it. I'm gonna go up in this jewel and get me some ginger shots. Hold on. Let me see. And then I'm about to go for a walk. 
and then I gotta run and take my auntie somewhere. The frequency ain't been frequencying at all, baby. Don't get me wrong, I've still been in a good vibes and all that kind of stuff, but I've been completely distracted. Eating wrong, you know what I'm saying? It don't feel the same, you know what I'm saying? Even though we still will still do it, we'll know like that. It's not me, huh? Then we'll do it again, huh? Do it again, it's just like so like, in bits and pieces like it, it just happened very slowly and you'll be end up back in a certain space and it's like no i feel it i know it in my mind my spirit in my heart with the food people you know what i'm saying just focusing on the wrong things like like making certain things a part of your focus that shouldn't be which is throwing off the, the, the right focus even if you focus on the right thing but still got the wrong thing in your focus at the same time it's like it's it's imbalancing the right focus it got the right focus shifting and, and tipping the other way and, and now you know what i'm saying this is up here now this is what you like no i feel like i'm about to like i was saying in my last vlog i was gonna start doing salmon wild caught salmon even though i don't really like the one that i had from aldi i didn't like how it tasted at all i really didn't but i think i'm about to do me um a salad like a salad fast just make me a big bowl of salad and just be eating off that just to kind of like start off with that and just to shift back over to the space of where i need to be or where i want to be or where i was with it you know not being so like welcoming lady i've been so welcoming to like okay i'm gonna eat this i'm gonna eat this i don't care i'm gonna just on some oh i'm gonna just be free i'm gonna do what i want to do whatever <laughs> like no nah, baby and still feeling that conviction every single time you hit me about to get it back together it ain't gonna be perfect at all it may still be some ups and downs but like i said i always shift back to what matters and what i should be doing like i was truly locked into myself truly locked into myself baby and i feel like that was the best place for me to be because to be locked into myself is to be locked in with god because of course i am a god made me in his image well to be locked in with god is to be locked in with self so i gotta get back to that <laughs> you feel me like the more and the joy and all of that like the, all of that is within me baby you know what i'm saying all that is me all of that i need is in me and within me yeah we get through off sometimes for sure like until we give up the idea that happiness is somewhere else you know what i'm saying like it'll never be where you at it'll never be where you are like that joy is somewhere else until we give up the idea that joy happiness and freedom and discipline and all that type of stuff until we give up the idea that it's somewhere else like it will never be where we are it will never be when we get caught up in this world this world these worldly things baby i promise you that's why i say that environment is so freaking important it matters i don't care what nobody say about oh if you focus and lock in on you it don't matter about environment it matters it pulls and it tugs at you is it possible to still do you and do what need to be done in the environment yes it is but it, it plays a huge role studies have been shown it was something that phil Kofer said in one of his videos and he was just talking how i'm talking something he said and i was like oh my god that's a word because i felt it he said you don't want to go back to keep going back and forth you don't want to go back to keep going back and forth that was a word it hit me so hard just to go back to things in general period overall whether it be people places or things don't go back just to keep going back and forth now you lose sight of where you need to be and what you need to be doing with food don't go back to certain food just to keep going back and forth and now you end up in a space where it's like now this is where i'm at with it i'm back to square one you feel me like no or people don't go back just to keep going back and forth and now you confused about where you need to be is what that means or where you should be or getting caught up in a place where you shouldn't be but yeah y'all like i'm gonna forever hold myself accountable like because every at the end of the day everything is for me everything is for me everything that i do that i feel everything whatever is just for me at the end of the day me and my kids of course but it, it, it started with me no matter what so it just be like It'd be, a, it'd be a me thing. 
because to be great for me, I can be great for everything else around me. And that's just how I want it to be. And I just need to change my mind again. You know what I'm saying? Shift back into that world that I was in. Get back to that world, to that space, to that place of, you know what I'm saying? Just creating my own world. Like I said in my on my other video, like creating your own world and living there. Create your own world and live there, especially in this world that we live in. We have to shut everything out the best way that we can and create our own world in our minds because our mind is our world. Our, our, our mind is our eyes. You know what I'm saying? That's how we see. <laughs> you know, so getting back into that bag for real. Like that's where I'm at with it. Starting off what what whenever. Even if you fall off, get back on that motherfucker. Period. Like man, just been distracted. I've been completely distracted because I went back just to go back and forth. When it comes to people and food. For surely have. For surely have, baby. You know, sometimes you just gotta look, I can't do this. I shouldn't be doing look, nope. But yeah, anyways, y'all. Last night, me, um, I think I may have dropped it in the clips prior to this clip. Um, me and my auntie, we went to um, Leroy's Hawkins poetry event at the Promontory. It's, it was called Poetry Over Prose. It was a decent event for sure. A decent, great vibe. You already know. Um, I had got him a little gift. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Nothing major at all. You feel me? Just something very thoughtful. Well, y'all, I was saying. Out here, got him a little gift or whatever. The event was nice and all of that. My camera had cut off. I'm a very thoughtful gift giver. That's just how I am. Like, I pay attention to detail. I pay attention to people. You know, the best way I can. Just always been like that. And a lot of times I just feel like less is more. That's how I feel. And I feel like it's always the thought behind it that'll make a person be like, dang, they thought about that or they put that much detail into it or that much thought into it, even though it was such a small gift, it was very big mentally. The thought of it was so major, you know what I mean? That's just how I am, but if you know, you know. If you don't, then you don't. I always see, I just noticed that he always got a toothpick in his mouth. You know what I'm saying? So I got some toothpicks. Not your ordinary toothpicks. I, I figured that I wouldn't be able to give it to him last night because of the kind of event it, it was. Now the last event, this camera must keep getting hot. The last event I went to, very intimate as y'all seen. Like touching, talking type intimacy, like in that vibe. Which it would have been better if I had had him that day. But that day I just gave him a t my brand, my t-shirt and my head or whatever. If he wear it, he do. If he don't, he don't. I wasn't doing it to get no promotion, none of that. It was just here. That's just that's just how I'm set up for the most part. Like, but um, yeah. So if he wears it, he wears it. If he doesn't, he doesn't. Like I, I didn't leave no card in there saying this is my brand da, 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 because with that, like y'all know, with that brand, it's kind of like it was a, a sh it was short lived. It, not saying that it's gone, it's not, no, it's still rare breed, that shit gonna live on, for, that shit gonna live on, going into other endeavors for sure, that ain't gonna go away. Yeah, so it wasn't with no, like, super intent behind it, like, yeah, you gonna promote my brand, and no, that wasn't what it was at all, that was just me being like, okay, let me come with something, you know, you got this that going on, that going on, or whatever, like, whatever, here go, uh, congratulations gift to me that's how I'm looking at it like whether I know you or not whatever but I got him some toothpicks y'all and I wasn't able to uh, I didn't even attempt to try to give it to him last night because I was so tired I was ready to go I was very tired but like I said I'm gonna hold on to him and I ain't gonna say if I do when I do see him again I'm gonna give it to him you know what I'm saying or I'm gonna have him sent you feel me but um yeah it was a nice event y'all it was very nice very nice I just feel like 
even though I don't know this person, it feels like home because you're from where I'm from. To me, it's just like, it feels like home at the end of the day. That's just my honest opinion. It feel like home. I feel like in one way or another, we can relate. Am I looking for something from this person? No, I am not. Nothing but, hey, let's be friends. You feel me like, and at first it was like, well, who are you to think that this person that's been on TV is going to be close to friends with you or to know you at all? That would be downplaying myself, downplaying my worth, downplaying who I am like I'm a nobody because I'm not famous. You know what I'm saying? Tell me how to have you seen the It was about five minutes ago When I seen the hottest chick that a youngin' never seen before I say yo, oh, tell the girl I wanna be up On second time that ain't the way to go I gotta do a game proper Spit it so she get it, there she is, I gotta stop her Or should I talk about a smile? Or what about a style? I'm out of time, she's out the door, I gotta go for a ride Chow is giving afro at this point. Whole joint done lifted up, baby. Let me put on my do rag. Hey y'all, I might put my locks back in. I don't know yet. So I might eventually get braids to kind of like help it to go back in. And by the summertime, next summer. It'll be lengthy enough. I wash them real good. Color them. We'll see. We will see. That walk was something. But, um. Ooh, hold on. I'm going back down now. I should have had this on while I was walking. I forget. But, um. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> like I was saying before my camera cut off. I was saying like. Don't never downplay yourself because you're not famous. Or feel like you're beneath or lower than someone because they're famous famous, and you're not. To me, I feel like people are still regular people. You breathe like I do and you bleed like I do. So it's like, it'll get in your mind like, who you think you is to even be involved or have or to know or to be in any type of circle with certain kind of people when you're this and you're th you know what i'm saying like no we gotta stop that we gotta stop that mindset like it's a battle though because it's like no i'm that like i'm i'm one of those ones so why not like i said i don't want nothing like that from it i just want to be amongst different circles of people i want to be and i'm worthy of that i feel like i want to be in connection and contact with people that not because they're famous or anything like that but simply because their level of thinking is different different perspective masculine energy for sure you know what i'm saying just bringing different stuff to the table mentally people i can relate to just different energy different vibes different relationships all 2024 and the rest of 2023 baby i'm claiming that you the biggest person in the room you gotta get in another room Yes. Get in another room because that means you have excelled where you are at right now. I always want to be around somebody that is getting more than me because yeah. they got so much more to teach me. You learn from. How the hell did you get this? How the hell did you make three million dollars in a year? I want to be in the room with you. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? You know, more growth, more love, more life, more living, more all of that, more healing. So do I have any type of intention with this man? No, I just want to be if it comes to be friends, that's enough for me. It ain't like I'm like, oh, I want to have sex with him. He's so this. That none of that I can literally say and honestly say none of that crossed my mind. In the past, it may have years ago, but now in the space I'm in now, that that's not crossing my mind. My camera finna die too, so if it die, I'm gonna get back on with y'all. But that's just not in my mind. That's not in my mind at all. I promise. I promise me it's not. But um, yeah. It just feels safe, like it feels like home. It feels familiar at the end of the day. And even if it doesn't, it's like relationships beyond familiar. I want relationships that's beyond the, f the feeling of familiar. It is what it is. Like who am I not to know certain people or be around certain people? Who am I not? Like I'm one of those ones, so why not? Like 
Don't play yourself because you're not famous. Oh, don't downplay yourself because you're not this or you're not here yet or whatever, whatever. Like, nah. That doesn't take away from who you are at heart, who what's in your mind, like what you can be, who you are. Like, it doesn't take away from that because you're not famous or you're not rich yet. I'm heavy on the yet. So, just want to run in different circles for sure. Like, that's just what it is. That's what it's going to be. And, and they ain't got to be famous. They ain't got to be rich. Just know more than me. And yeah, be more than me at the end of the day. I'm looking at the mind and the heart. I want to form relationships with a person's mind and heart. Not what they have or what they can do for me. Like, no. All that kind of stuff is minimum. It's, it's basic. You need a bath, dude. You look so dirty. Never get a white dog. And I don't wanna tell you to drop me But I don't wanna play your game Yeah, something That makes me look at you too often oh, Baby, you can give us something Baby, I can run all the time Baby, I'm talking crazy I need you right in my space But I need it, baby, I'm late But I'm sick of checking with you